this stuff. And it's pretty heady to, to come up here and be treated like royalty. And it really went to his head. He did not end very well. So, but the point is we can do things for the Lord. And then we can pray and ask the Lord, do this through us. And then he starts moving. We've got to make sure. We have to be cautious. Constantly make sure that we give the glory <coughs> to the Lord. He doesn't share his glory. He may bless us in a rich way. But we need to guard against you know, acting like somehow we're special, we've got to guard against feeling like we deserved it, guard against thinking I'm better than somebody else. That's where the, that's where the danger comes in. Christopher Columbus was a great man of God, but then he got caught up in some stuff inside of himself that caused him to not end so very well. But in the meantime, we can truly celebrate that here's a man who had the call of Jesus on his life, and as a result of that, he discovered America. How does that fit in with us? I believe that we should be people with determination. We should be people of faith. We need to be people of vision. We also need to be people that provides leadership. Every one of us is called to be a leader in one place or another. And so we take that, recognizing people are going to look up at us and follow us and go to, we can be role models. Every single one of us is a role model to somebody. So we have to be cautious about that to make sure that we fulfill the destiny that the Lord has called upon us. And when the, we do things right and the Lord blesses us, let us work really hard to make sure we give Him all the glory. Because that's really where the key is. Let's stand now as we pray.